Shante. This is the Avyakt Murli of 8th of January 2023, original date 23 of April 1993. Title is May you have an intellect filled with faith. May you be immortal. Brackets accepting the love filled invitation from all the senior brothers and sisters who had come for the celebration of their silver jubilee. Avyakt Babdada came into the gathering of the children for half an hour and after giving sweet drashti to everyone spoke a few elevated versions. At the end, Baba waved goodbye and took leave from everyone. Today, Babdada has come to celebrate a meeting with all the extremely loving souls, those who have been cooperative in the establishment of the Yajna from the beginning, those who have been victorious on the basis of their intellects having faith and who have passed the papers of the many different types of problems and those souls who have been loving, cooperative, unshakable and immovable from the beginning. Baba has come to those children who are moving along having passed in the subject of faith. This faith will constantly continue to give you the experience of victory in this life and in your future lives. The blessings of faith and immortality is constantly with you. Today, Baba has especially come because of the remembrance and bond of love of the experienced. Mature souls brackets elderly Brahmins over a long period of time. Congratulations for your faith. On the one side, there are the foundation souls of the Yajna, that is, those of the fort of the Pandavas. In front of Baba, and on the other side are all of you experienced souls of the very beginning, the first breaks of the wall of the fort of the Pandavas. The foundation is in front of Baba and the first breaks on the basis of which the fort has become strong and a canopy of protection for the world are also in front of Baba. So just as Baba out of love for the children has demonstrated the part of Ji Haju Ji Ji Hajur Hajir brackets Yes my Lord I am present and become present in front of the children. In the same way, constantly continue to say G Hazir brackets present my Lord to the Srimad and directions of Babdada and the instrument souls. Do not ever mix wasteful manmat or parmat with this. 
knowing the Lord to be present on the basis of following Srimad, continue to fly. Samja, brackets, understand. Acha, Bab Dada is speaking to Madhuban residents while giving them congratulations for their service. Acha, many many congratulations, especially to the Madhuban residents. Throughout the whole season, you have been instruments to serve everyone with your sweetness and tireless service. So, many many congratulations to the Madhuban residents in particular as they are the first ones who are the instrument servers for the whole season. Madhuban is honey that is sweetness. Sweetness makes everyone love the father and this is why whether they are sitting in the hall or have gone away, Bab Dada is giving each department special congratulations for their service with the blessing. May you be tireless and sweet and continue to move forward and fly. Personal meetings with Avyakt Bab Dada. Number one, carelessness brings weakness and therefore always remain alert. All of you are the elevated souls of the confluence age, are you not? What is the speciality of the confluence age? which no other A's has. The speciality of the confluence A's is that you receive instant fruit and you also experience multi-million fold return of one in this birth itself. You receive instant fruit, do you not? If you have courage for even a second, for how much longer do you continue to receive help? When you serve even one person, you receive so much happiness. So multi-million fold attainment from one means you receive the instant fruit at the confluence age itself. So, you enjoy eating fresh fruit, do you not? So, all of you are those who eat instant fruit, that is, fresh fruit. And this is why you are powerful. You are not weak, are you? All of you are powerful. Do not allow any weakness to come. When you are healthy, weakness automatically finishes. You constantly continue to receive power from the Almighty Authority Father. So how can you be weak? Can weakness come? Does it come by mistake? When you go to sleep as Kumbhakarna while being careless, it can come. Otherwise, it cannot come. All of you are alert, are you not? Are you careless? Are all of you alert? Are you always alert? 
at the confluence is when you found the father you found everything so you would remain alert would you not those who continually receive so many attainments remain so alert when businessmen profit in their business would they be careless or be alert so how much do you receive in a second so how can you be careless the father has given you all attainments since all powers are with you carelessness cannot come always remain clever always remain cautious bab dada always says uk is okay so those who are okay are okay because they are alert the foundation is powerful and this is why all the twigs and branches that have emerged are also powerful baba and father brahma have specially laid the first foundation with their heart in london it is especially loved by father brahma so you so you souls always have a right to the instant fruit even before you perform any action its fruit is ready for you it feels like that doesn't it or does it feel like hard work while singing and dancing you continue to eat the fruit in any case you double foreigners like fruit do you not bab dada too is pleased to see the children who are in the uk and so okay always remember this title of yours it is the best title all of you are those who remain constantly okay and also make others okay with your faces your words and attitudes this is the service you have to do is it not it is good and you have a good interest in serving whoever has come from wherever all of you are intense effort makers and those in the flying stays who remains the happiest say with intoxication i do apart from happiness what else is there happiness is the nourishment of for brahmin life how can you move along with your nourishment you are moving along but it is because you are receiving nourishment that you are moving along the places are also increasing look earlier it used to be a big deal to get 3 feet of land and what does it feel like now it feels easy does it not so london has performed wonders brackets we have now received 50 acres of land purchase of the global retreat center those who give courage to others are good and those who remain courageous are also good look how could it have happened if it weren't for each one's finger so every one of you from the uk is lucky and is courageous in giving your finger second hand over all your responsibilities to the father 
and become carefree emperors. Do you constantly experience yourselves to be carefree emperors? Or are there a few worries? Since the father has taken your responsibility, why would you worry about responsibility? The only responsibility you have now is to move along with the father. That too is to move along with the father, not alone. So what worry do you have? Do you worry about what is going to happen tomorrow? Do you worry about your job? Do you have any worries about what is going to happen in the world? It is because you know that whatever is going to happen, it will be good for you. You have this faith, do you not? Is it firm faith or does it sometimes sake? Where there is firm faith, victory is guaranteed with that faith. You also have the faith that victory is guaranteed, do you not? Or do you sometimes think about whether you will have victory or not? You are victorious every cycle and will always be. You are once again seeing your memorial of the previous cycle, are you not? You have this much faith, do you not? That you are victorious every cycle. Do you have this much faith? It was you in the previous cycle too, was it not? Or was it someone else? So always remember that you are the victorious jewels whose intellects have faith. You are such jewels that even Bab Dada remembers you. You have this happiness, do you not? You stay in a lot of pleasure, do you not? Congratulations for this alokic divine elevated birth and of arriving at your home, Madhuban. Number 3. The father and I remain combined in such a way that no one can ever separate you. Do all of you experience yourselves to be constantly combined with the Father? No one can ever separate those who remain combined. You have been combined many times. You are now and will always be in the future too. Is this firm? So constantly remain very strongly combined. So always be aware. We were combined, we are combined and we will constantly be combined. No one has the power to separate those who have remained combined countless times. What is the sign of love? Brackets to remain combined. Physically, even out of compulsion, you sometimes have to stay apart. There may be love, but in certain circumstances, you have to stay apart. However, here it is not a question of the body, brackets, physical. You can go somewhere far away in a second. There is the company of souls with God. God fulfills the responsibility of his company anywhere and he fulfills the responsibility of love with each one in the combined form. 
what would each one say my baba or would they say your baba each one would say my baba so why do you say mine it is because you have a right did you say this you have love and you also have a right where there is love there is also a right you have the intoxication of having this right do you not you have received such a huge right you will not receive such a huge right even in the golden age you don't have godly rights in any other age you have this attainment here the reward is in the golden age but the time of attaining is now so there is so much happiness when you attain something once you have attained something it becomes common but while you are attaining something the intoxication and happiness of that time is alokic so you have so much happiness and intoxication because the one who is giving is also unlimited so the bestower is unlimited and what you receive is unlimited so what are you a master of the limited or the unlimited you made all the three worlds belong to you the incorporeal world and the subtle reasons are your home your kingdom is going to come in the physical world so you have a right to all three worlds so who are you souls who have a right do you lack anything what song do you sing brackets i have attained that which i wanted to attain i have attained what i wanted what i wanted now nothing remains to be attained so do you sing this song or are you lacking something i want money i want a house i want a politician seat you want nothing because even if you have a seat of some position there is no guarantee for even one birth whereas how much guarantee do you have you have a guarantee of 21 births maya hasn't stolen your guarantee card has she just as when you lose your passport everything becomes so difficult so maya hasn't taken your guarantee card has she she plays hide and seek so what do you do then become so powerful that maya does not have any courage number 4 perform every action as a trikaldarshi do all of you experience yourselves to be souls seated on your throne what would you say have you received your throne now or will you receive it in the future will everyone sit on sit on a throne brackets the heart throne is very big the heart throne is big but how many will sit on the golden age throne at one time anyone can be seated on the throne but you will be 
part of the royal family of those who have a right to the throne will you not you will not all be able to sit on the throne together will you at this time all of you are seated on a throne and this is why there is the importance of this birth however many and whoever wants to can be seated on the hard throne is there any other throne at this time which one brackets akal takht the immortal throne the throne of you imperishable souls is the forehead so you are seated on the throne of the forehead and also on the heart throne you have double thrones do you not do you have the intoxication of being a soul seated on the immortal throne of the forehead a soul who is seated on the throne has sovereignty over the self and this is why such a soul is a master of the self having the awareness of self sovereignty easily gives you the experience of all attainments from the father so you have the knowledge of all three thrones you are knowledgeful are you not are you also powerful or are you just knowledgeful are you just as powerful as you are knowledgeful or are you more knowledgeful and less powerful you are cleverer in knowledge you are knowledgeful and also powerful both so stay constantly aware of all three thrones in knowledge there is the importance of threes you know about the three aspects of time or do you simply know about the present time whenever you perform any action do you perform it as a trikaldarshi or do you act while only knowing one aspect of it who are you knowers of one aspect of time or three aspects of time do you know what is going to happen tomorrow you say we know that whatever is going to happen tomorrow will be very good you know this much do you not so that makes you trikal darshi does it not whatever has already happened was good what is happening is even better and whatever is going to happen will be very good you have the faith do you not that whatever will happen will be the best nothing bad can happen why you have found the best of all fathers you have become the best of all and you are performing the best of all actions so everything is good is it not or is it a little bad and a little good since you know that you are elevated souls then the thoughts words and actions of elevated souls would be the best of all would they not so is stay constantly aware that since you have found the benevolent father there is always benefit and more benefit 
the father is called the world benefactor and you are master world benefactors since you are those who benefit the world there cannot be anything that is not beneficial for you this is why you must have the faith that every moment every task and every thought is beneficial the confluence age is also called the beneficial age so there cannot be anything where there is no attainment so what will you remember whatever is happening and whatever is going to happen will be the best of all this awareness will constantly continue to make you move forward acha you are hoisting the father's flag everywhere in the world all of you are moving forward with courage and intense effort and you will continue to move forward you can see the future can you not when anyone ask you what your future is tell them we know it is the best of all blessing may you become a carefree emperor and free from all worries by seeing the elevated line of your fortune on your forehead the sovereignty of being carefree is the highest sovereignty of all if someone puts on a crown and sits on a throne but continues to worry then is that being seated on a throne or is it or is that worry god the bestower of fortune has drawn the line of your elevated fortune on your foreheads and so you have become carefree emperors so always continue to see your elevated line of fortune on your forehead wah my elevated godly fortune maintain this spiritual intoxication and all worries will finish slogan invoking souls with the power of concentration and by doing spiritual service is real service slogan invoking souls with the power of concentration and by doing spiritual service is real service om shante